I would like everybody to take a good close look at the black umbrella top shade for this hurricane deck boat, okay? And, and I want you to look at it in relationship to the black on the hull side. This right here, guys, is severely oxidized gel coat, and the boat's not that old. It's a 2007, and in fact, this is a hurricane deck boat. This is called the 257 model. Now what we want to do is we want to restore the severely oxidized gel coat, and you see the black, just how far gone it's gone. Um, it's only nine years old. We want to bring that back to its original color. This is kind of challenging. This is black gel coat. This isn't that easy yeah. to bring back. True. All right? I know you make a lot of different products in the line. Where would we begin on a very short-term duration, time-wise, on a restoration of the, of the Hurricane Deck boat? Where do we begin? Well, we sell it in a package. We have polyprep, which is a concentrate. Mix it with water. It's a degreaser, okay. and it takes wax stains and light oxidation off. Okay, now this is a special type of degreaser, guys. Some of them can hurt your vinyl graphics. This one will not. Yeah, and, just mix, um, mix it three to one, right? spray it on, scrub the boat down thoroughly. Kind of just like you're washing the boat. Right. Now, on the other side of the boat, we have some, uh, some rust dripping from some through holes. Yes. What do you make that would remove that rust as well as remove the oxidation from the actual hull side? Because you see how that black kind of looks gray right now. Yep. Okay, that's oxidized, my friend. Yep. We have another product called Polyox. It's a powder, a mild abrasive. It's got a little bit of a solic acid in it. And the way you use this is you wet the area, wet the scrub pad that comes with it, sprinkle some on here, and you can scrub it down with that. That'll get rid of the, the rust stains on the other side, and we'll clean up the oxidation on this side. Give everybody a little advice, especially when you're talking about the colored gel coat. How much scrubbing do we want to use with the polyox? We want to make sure that it's a uniform color. There's no mottled effect where there's light areas and dark areas. Everything has to be the same color. Okay, so now we need to, once that's all done, the entire boat, we need to rinse it off with fresh water and we need to dry it. Now, I want to get into the Miracle product here in the line, okay, okay. the Polyglow. Yes. All right, what is it? How much do we apply? How many coats? Well, Polyglow is a liquid. <clears throat> what you do is we have a, a microfiber mitt and you take this and wet it with water, wring it out really good, stick it in a towel, wring it out some more so it's just barely damp. Put one of our disposable gloves, which comes in our kit, on, pour the Polyglow, on the, on the mitt, kind of squish it together like this, and you can wipe it on. It goes on very quickly uh, and smoothly. Okay. And you put multiple coats. With a black boat, I would put five coats on, um, and just one coat will dry within a minute or two, and you put another coat right back over it. Here's where we began, guys. Here's about three hours time, and we're talking about a nominal cash investment. Let's first start off with the kit right here. This is what you would get and inside the kit, you kind of have, you know, almost everything that you need. You have the, you have the poly prep, you have the poly glow, the instructions, you have the scrubby, you have the mitt, you have the gloves that go underneath the mitt. You are also going to have to get the polyox to get rid of the oxidation. Okay, so three hours time, this is what you could do with a fiberglass boat that's gel coated. This is what you could do with an RV. This is what you could do for a camper. 